Vector Slav, Vector Slav, Vector Slav. Shots fired. Clear. Two greens. We got a casualty over here. Clear in this kid. Go, 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 go. Everybody saw that? So now I cover his back, contacts down there, he finishes that space, and then we're, we keep on moving on. The room is finally clear. Everybody understand? You gotta cut everything a piece at a time, okay? Do not try to rush in there. Training is, is paramount. Uh, we absolutely spend countless hours on training to ensure our guys are, are better prepared for any threats that are out there. For me personally, I, I take it to heart because I would much rather have them mess up here and mess up uh, in a real life scenario. Bottom right target, no time limit. Shooter, stand by. So our range is available to all the local law enforcement and all the other units on the base. We try our best to stay proactive to uh, ensure the safety of our shipmates, our family, and, and our friends, as well as everything on base. Primarily, we use dogs for deployments. While they're here, CONUS, the dogs are utilized just to augment security personnel, whether it be explosive detection, drug detection, patrol utilization, whatever it may be, they're just a force multiplier. It's called a psychological deterrent, essentially. When people see dogs, they don't know what it's trained in. It's a deterrent for any type of negativity to come on the base to stray away from them. Bush, who was with MA2 Marsh, recently patrol certified, really high speed, low drag, Belgian Malinois. Probably our go-to dog for this base, especially if anything happens patrol oriented. Good job, bud. Our training staff has to be the best. They're basically weeded out of our department to ensure that they have one, fully qualified, uh, two, are really, really good at their job. Three are the type of people that can be instructors. They're definitely the best of the best.